All right, Lauren, in the North Valley now, small businesses in Merced suffering from storm damage are getting a little extra help. The U.S. Small Business Association opening a business recovery center. CBS 47's Ben Morris live in studio to break down the relief that businesses could qualify for. U.S. Small Business Association saying this center could provide you with millions of dollars in relief. Their PIO asking that if your business did sustain damages or economic injury, that you head down as soon as you can. Extensive flooding hit Merced County in the month of January, most visibly in the communities of Planada and the city of Merced. The impact continuing long after the flooding is gone. The U.S. Small Business Association says there's a great need to rebuild and fix the damage. So that business is going to suffer, the, the, the whole community is going to suffer it as a whole. So that the earlier or the sooner we can help the businesses recover, that the sooner that the whole community is going to be able to recover. According to Javier Caltanko, the recovery center's PIO, businesses are entitled to up to a 30-year, $2 million loan to help with damage to buildings or equipment. Funding would help with things like paying rent, utilities, or employees. They don't have to pay uh, the interest and they don't have to make a payment for the first 12 months. So we were waiving that for temporarily. The team here is ready to lend a helping hand. You'll just need to head down to apply for relief before the deadline of March 16th for physical damages or the October 16th deadline for help with things like rent or utilities. We have individuals here, representatives who will be able to assist them, as I mentioned, with questions with their application process uh, and any, any doubts, they will be able to help them with that. Businesses outside Merced County could also be eligible for the financial help. To get started, bring an ID and tax documents from the last three years to the UC Merced Downtown Campus Center. That's where the Recovery Center is located. Reporting live in studio, Ben Morris, CBS 47 Eyewitness News. All right, Ben, important information to know. Thank you, my friend.